Hello and welcome to Redmine X. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you the features of our gun chart. Let's kick this off with the global gun, which is accessible from the main menu. Global gun is a place where you can see all the projects within the system, their tasks and milestones. You can expand and collapse the projects like this. And naturally, you can update the position of the task in time, or change the due date. You can also update the task's completion. And the same applies to milestones, where you can change the due date as well. And on top of that, you can easily create relations between tasks. On top, you have the zoom level which allows you to zoom the gun chart into days, weeks, months or even years. Then you can display the full week or just work days. And here you can display the tasks according to their priorities. And don't forget that any change within the gun chart requires to hit the save button. Otherwise your changes will be lost. If anything should go wrong, there is always the undo button, which will move you one step back in time. You can display additional info by double-clicking the task. And if you want to, you can go to the task detail by using this link. So this is the global gun chart, which shows all the projects and tasks within the system. And if you want to focus on a particular project, just navigate yourself into the project detail. And in the project menu, you will find the project gun chart. It has almost identical features compared to the global gun. Here is the zoom level, where you can display days, weeks, months or years. You can display the full week or just work days. Or you can filter priorities. In the project level gun chart, there is an additional feature, show critical path, which simply displays the critical path of your project. In the left part, you can use the inline edit feature. You can edit the task name, duration, and start date and due date. Right within the gun chart, you can create new entities. By using one of these plus icons, you can create tasks and subtasks. If you click the plus in the project row, you will create a new task within the project. Just fill in the description and leave the type as task if you want to create a task. Later, you can easily change the task duration or the position of the task in time. And if you want to, you can create a task relation just like this. If you click on the plus in the task row, you will create a subtask. Regarding the relations, there are two types. The first one is precedes follows, which can have a given delay. And the second one is a simple finish to start relation. If you created a fixed type delay, the tasks will always be tied together like this. The last feature of our Redmine Gunt chart is export. You can export to PDF, PNG, Microsoft Excel and MS Project. Thanks for watching the Gunchar tutorial. We wish you a lot of successful projects with Redmine X.